Hello everybody and welcome to Uprising 144K. I'm Hydrogen Man. Okay guys, today I have kind of a sad story really, though there is some incredible information I want to share with you guys today. Very touching though, pretty sad. Let me just tell you what's going on. So there's a gentleman who I've been talking to for a little while now. This gentleman has a child. I believe he's around eight years old. This boy, is, this boy has some very rare form type of cancer. And so the prognosis doesn't look really, really good. So it's a very sad thing. However, we were talking about, this gentleman has been trying a lot of different treatments. And just for the, those of you who don't know, a lot of the treatments can be very oxidative to the body and just really, really hard on people in general. And this child has really been suffering and these treatments oftentimes make him sick. But more recently, he was not doing so good and he was taken to the hospital where they finally decided, they actually kept him there and they decided, you know, they're gonna actually put the child through chemotherapy. One of the things that they did is apparently they're giving chemotherapy through like the IV and they're going to give it, you know, orally. But one of the things that they recently did was they put a spinal tap where they actually put the chemotherapy in his spine, in the spinal fluid, which I'm sure is going to be reaching the brain. And, you know, it's, it's very, very aggressive form of treatment. And obviously chemotherapy is highly, highly oxidative, guys. So this is what ended up happening. Apparently the child afterwards was not doing very good. In fact, the father was like, this just, he didn't seem like my son. He was, you know, like a zombie. His eyes were all dilated and rolling kind of into the back of his head. And he was just, he was not doing well. And so one of the things that he did was, and thank goodness he had, he actually has the exact same device that I do. He has the Hydrofix. He used this exact same type of canola, this special headset, it's called a deluxe canola for inhaling the hydrogen gas. And so ultimately what happened, guys, is he put him on the hydrogen gas inhalation, which, you know, goes into your brain, which is one of the benefits of hydrogen gas inhalation. Well, when he shared the story with me, he said that after the 30-minute session, because the machine will run for like 30 minutes, after the 30-minute session, his son, he said, was completely back to normal. He was back, he was bouncing off the walls again, and just being a kid, I was just so, not just impressed, but I was so touched, like I was feeling so grateful that this equipment exists. I was so happy that he had the right type of equipment. And I was so happy for his son that he was feeling better because feeling sick is, abs I mean, being sick is one thing and that's terrible, but then feeling sick on top of that or having to go through something like chemotherapy, guys, absolutely just terrible. So I'm, I was so happy and I was like, I gotta share this story with people. They have to know about this because for those of you who don't know, in Japan, they've been known to use hydrogen in combination with chemotherapy. You know, one of the interesting things that they've seen in Japan is that they've been able to use less of the chemotherapy yet get even greater results. And then of course, people don't nearly get as sick or even sick at all. So they have been doing that over in Japan. And that's obviously something really, really important to do, at least in my opinion, when you're doing something like chemotherapy, because it can make you so sick and the level of oxidative stress and the rate of cellular damage and the protection that hydrogen appears to offer, not just from the oxidative stress, but it can protect cells that would ordinarily be damaged with the chemotherapy. And we're talking in huge numbers that it has a, a way to protect the body. Hence the reason also, you know, places like NASA, for example, are thinking about using it for their astronauts because of the amount of exposure that they get when they're in outer space to radiation. Anyway, guys, I thought it was an absolutely incredible uh, story. And I mean, I don't know if you can wrap your mind around that, but I mean, imagine somebody like this child who is having all this chemo going through his brain, guys. I mean, that's crazy. And then just a 30 minute session, he was feeling so much better. I thought it was an incredible story. I just think it shows how incredible hydrogen is and the true power of hydrogen. Of course, when it's used correctly, proper levels, all those things are always important and made properly and safely. You know, all those are very important, but I was just really grateful and I wanted to share this information with you guys. I really hope that you found it helpful and informative. As usual, if you did, give the video a thumbs up or even if just to support the channel, don't forget to subscribe and definitely don't forget to share, guys. There's a lot of people out there who are either going through chemotherapy or they have some medical issue or they're suffering and they just don't know about hydrogen. The world doesn't seem to know about this really much yet. So I think it's important to share and don't forget to hit the notification button so you keep getting notifications when I put these videos out. And that's it, guys. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys next time on the next video.